Hello everybody, we are back here on the Hunter Classic and it is finally time for the Halloween event and we're going to go out and try to complete the Halloween mission along with uh, taking out some of the werewolves. There is a brand new fur type for the werewolves this go around and that is the golden werewolf which is going to be pretty interesting to go after. But uh, we need to collect a bunch of these different colors of skulls for the mission and also kill a bunch of different uh, werewolves. So. Let's uh, get started and see what we can do. Let's try to stick to the roads. It's much easier to take them out when you're actually on a flat surface. So that's what we're going to do. Now, considering it's been an entire year since we got to hunt werewolves, I'm hoping my aim is going to be on point. Uh, I don't exactly remember the exact strategy for taking these things out efficiently. So we're going to have to partially wing it. But provided we hit them, even if we don't kill them, we should be okay. Oh, here we go. Oh, are you kidding me? Is that a golden one already? Oh, are you kidding me? I just let a golden one get away. Oh my gosh. Well, it'll probably attack us again at some point. I can't believe I just let a golden one get away. Wow. Well, oh, there's another. There we go. So that is our first uh, werewolf down. Uh, kind of sad to let that golden one get away, but uh, we should hopefully get another shot at it at some point. That is a 265 scoring female. I'm pretty sure a big one is like 370 plus if I'm not mistaken or somewhere around that range. We'll probably uh, check that out later. We can always tax any crazy big ones after the hunt's done. So uh, the question now is do we try to chase down that gold one? Kind of feeling like it's not worth it, so we're just going to continue on. Uh-oh. So, I just heard one over to the right, and now we got one to the left as well. Uh, this could get pretty crazy. There we go. Maybe we'll be fine. This one is just a female, so uh, let's just grab her real quickly. 251. A little bit lower scoring than the last. Uh, let's just keep our eyes open and... Hope that we don't get blindsided. Oh, here we go. Let's, uh... There we go, another female. Well, we're getting a lot of female ones. Uh, nothing... male yet. I'm still sad that that golden one got away. That would have been the first interesting thing. So I just heard, like, two or th three... <laughs> over in that direction. That's not good. That's really not good. If we get charged by all three at once, we are dead. There, there's no surviving that. Oh, here we go. Oh, oh no. Yep, yeah, yep, that was... Oh, that's a gold one. I, I'm pretty sure that's a gold. Up, oh, yep, yep, uh, once again. <laughs> Every time a gold one shows up, something bad happens. That, uh, that figures. Well... And here comes more. <laughs> there we go. Anyone else? Okay, I think we're good. Let's uh, pick this one up now. I think that's a little bit heavier than some of them that we've been getting. Yeah, 267, so that's the best one so far. And you know, it appears that this is actually the same gold one that we shot earlier. So I think we are just going to hang around this area until it attacks us... Uh, in a way where we can actually kill it because uh, both times that it's attacked us it went terribly I, I want to eventually get it down just so we can have one of them but uh yeah I don't know how this is gonna go let's uh hope that's it if it is it then we actually have a decent uh, angle to take it out this might be the one where we actually get to smoke it yep here's our gold There we go. It is just a female, but this is our first uh, rare of the event. Let's go ahead and grab that. The Golden Werewolf. Uh, only a 260, but let's get a quick trophy shot. And then I might actually tax this one. Or, uh, well, we probably won't tax it now. We'll uh, tax it once we know whether or not this is going to be um, our biggest gold one of the event. It's probably not going to be, but uh, we'll see. Let's uh, go with something like 
probably that. I think that looks decent. Yeah, it's not too bad right there. We'll go with that for our first trophy shot of the event. I guess uh, before we get any further in this video, I should probably mention that if anybody is new to this event, the way that you can join this and uh, have fun blasting these werewolves as well is get yourself one of the Wolfsbane weapons. There's the Wolfsbane uh, 308 handgun and then also the Wolfsbane crossbow. I think it's like a hand crossbow. Uh, they should both be on sale right now or at least one of them. Uh, get those and then use the uh, silver ammunition that's provided for them and you'll be able to take out these werewolves just like uh, I am right now. It's quite a bit of fun. I definitely recommend trying the event out if you haven't in the past. I believe it's going to be going on pretty much for like the next week. Uh, probably like five or six days left by the time this video goes live. So get on, get in on the action if you haven't already. It is a lot of fun. And with that new golden fur type, it's even better than it was last year. Oh, oh, I definitely hear one near me. I'm uh, kind of slow walking because I heard a elk up here and I wanted to see if it was anything big. Because it would be kind of cool to get a big elk or mule deer during this event. But I uh, definitely hear one really close to me. So I'm a little bit worried that we're going to get attacked while I'm trying to stock up on this elk. Honestly, the sound of the werewolves making their little call never gets old. However, there is three of them after me at once, so that, that does get old. Oh my gosh. Well... I think that's an albino. Um, I don't really know. It's kind of dark here. Um, oh, great. Oh, no. Let's uh, try to get some more silver bullets in because we've got at least two more that called. Uh-oh. Well, it's at least wounded. At the very minimum, that gets it out of our hair, at least. And that one, I'm actually not sure how it didn't die, but... I, I think we hit it again? To be honest, I have no clue. We got two of them, though. I was just trying to stay alive in that situation. There was so much going on. Four of them at once. Uh, that is another female, 294. What is it with all of the female werewolves? We're not finding any males hardly at all. But we did finally get an albino, so I mean, there's that at least. And that one's also a female. Uh, we'll take a quick trophy shot, but I'm not going to tax this because I've already got a better one. Unfortunately, the lighting was bad where we were, so we're just going to have to deal with this far away trophy shot to get decent lighting so we can actually even tell that it's an albino, so we'll just uh, go with that. It's a, not a great looking trophy shot, but you know, whatever. I'll take it. This area seems to be a hot spot for the werewolves. We just heard two more call and I barely moved like 50 yards from where we last uh, fought the four. This area just seems really good for them. And that was a bad shot. We uh, at least got vitals. But the thing about these werewolves is if you don't drop them, a lot of times you really don't see them again. At least not for a very long time. So unfortunately that was a pretty poor shot to make. And once again, two at once, we are just not catching a break today. That is like three encounters in a row where it's at least two. And here one of them comes. Let's uh, see what we can do here. There we go. And that one is a male. That's actually a decent estimate as well. 310 to 390. Maybe this will end up being a giant. Uh, we do have more coming towards us though. There we go. That's also a male, a little bit smaller. And should be one more. I think. Yeah, one more. Let's uh, get this guy down as well. And that is a female. So that went a lot better than the last encounter of uh, three plus. So let's just grab the female first because that's the smallest of all of them, 248. And then this is the big guy. We'll save him for last. This was the smaller male. 
Yeah, let's see what this one ends up scoring. So this is a 299, and that is actually one that we hit twice. Wow. So I'd say this was probably one of the four that attacked us, most likely. That uh, seems to be what it was. Now, let's go ahead and grab this one. This one has a chance of being pretty good, and it ends up scoring 337.85. I believe that's decent, but I think you need at least like 360 or 370 for it to be a good one. Uh, like I was saying, we'll uh, get a trophy shot anyway, and then if it's tax worthy, then we will uh, do that at the end of the video. Because I really don't fully remember what a good werewolf is. But I'm sure some of you guys will tell me down in the comments. So be sure to uh, do that if you guys know a little bit more about it than I do. We'll just uh, go with that right there. I think that's an interesting looking trophy shot. I kind of like it. Another thing that I should probably mention is these guys are actually really good for uh, getting gems. Uh, because of the fact that you get so many of them charging at you throughout the time that you're playing, you'll easily be able to make a decent amount of gems. Uh, not to mention the Halloween mission gives a good amount of gems too. I think it's 6,666. Then you also get a two-person tree stand and I think like a trophy. It's a pretty awesome... Uh, mission to do if you want to get a little bit of gear and rewards for the Halloween mission. A uh, great way to get it without having to grind a bunch of the normal missions. And then you can use that uh, two-person tree stand for something like the golden tree stand and then you'd be able to make even more money. So it's really a great time to uh, get into this game. If you are able to purchase the Wolfsbane weapons then I'd say it's definitely worth uh, trying to finish that mission. Ah, uh, sounds like we got another one. Yep. Um, why did he just turn? Well, <laughs> that's unfortunate. I, I don't think it would have been bigger than what we've been getting, but... That was really strange. It turned at the last second to kind of, like, dodge us. I'm not entirely sure what just happened. I guess it might have been the tree behind us. It was probably swerving to try and miss that. That's, uh, unfortunate. Uh-oh. That is, uh, once again, the second call from this area. So, we're about to get chased by two. I've got one bullet left in this box. So, we're gonna have to do a ammo switch mid-charge. Uh, Let's, uh, see what we can do here. And I shot over its back. So, uh, <laughs> we're not even gonna get to, uh, go for the second one. This is going great. This is just absolutely wonderful. And, oh my gosh, that's another. Well, the first one smoked us. And now I think we've got two more that are angry. There we go, that went a lot better. Now for the second one, whenever it decides to charge. I'm starting to think that that last uh, roar was from this one, actually. So I think it just called a second time because of the fact that we died. Uh, this one's a bit smaller than the last one, 294, so not a giant. Uh, still a male, though. Glad that we're at least getting some of the males down because they give a lot more gems than the females do, so it's uh, nice to see those at least, even if that one is not a giant. Unfortunately, today I've got the reaction time of a sloth. I feel like the coffee has just not kicked in, so we've been missing a fair few of the shots that I normally would be able to hit, which is a bit unfortunate. We've been shooting over the backs and shooting them in the foot and uh, all kinds of things that shouldn't happen, but I mean, it is what it is. At the same time, these werewolves are kind of fast, so it's not super easy to get your shots perfect every time, so... I'd say we're doing okay considering I haven't done something like this in a full year. Here we go. Okay, this one's gonna be perfect, I think. There we go, just a female though. I believe that was the only one that called from around here too, so let's just grab her real quickly. 132.7, that's actually a decent sized female at 292.47. Not bad, not bad at all. That one gives a decent amount of gems because it is a larger female. Ooh, there we go. There is one of the red skulls. I decided to uh, fast travel back to where we started and try to look for some of the skulls. 
in the fields over here. It's going to be harder to kill the werewolves when we're in uneven ground, but at the same time I need to get a few of these skulls for the mission anyway, so I figured we might as well finish it off by doing that. Uh, sounds like we do have another one. The water might kind of mess with its path though. Yeah, I think that's definitely happening. This is risky, but I'm going to do it. I think it's stuck. I, I think this is a bad idea, but I'm going to do it for you guys. We're going after the stuck werewolf. Oh, I don't like this. Oh, I really don't like this. That's a big one, too. And we didn't get a vital shot. Oh my gosh, that was a big one too, up to 390. Man, that could have been an amazing uh, werewolf to get. I, I don't know if that second shot killed it or not. I think we hit it, but I don't think we killed it. Wow, we gotta chase that thing down. It will eventually die because we did get lungs and that was a big one, so I really want to uh, make sure we go get it. Oh gosh, we got another one that's about to come over here while we're trying to do this. This is not going to go well. I can already tell that. Yep, here it goes. Let's uh, do our best here. And it hit the dip right as it got to us. Now, this is why you want to fight them on the roads, because it's not easy to do it anywhere else. You have stuff like that happen quite often when you try to fight them in other places. But we got to track this thing down. It was a big one. Okay, so that might be him. I'm going to get ready just in, in case. This, oh gosh, there's two. Well, here goes nothing. Yep, here he comes. Oh my gosh, both of them at once. Well, that's an albino, and I think that was our guy. Nope, that's, uh, that's a female. Okay, we're good. <laughs> well, we got an albino. Not what I was after, or actually that might be a gold? No, that's an albino, it's gotta be. Is it a male? It is! And that's actually a decent one at 336.9. You know, I think that might be the best albino I've killed. It might not be, but I mean it's the best one that we've killed this event. Alright, we'll just go with uh, that right there. It's about the best we're gonna get on this terrible slope. Uh, we're not going to tax it yet. I'm going to have to go check to see what our best albino is. And uh, if that's our best one, then we'll end up taxing it. Okay, we got a race to the road. Because we got... Oh, never mind. We're not going to make it. Ah, uh, we hit it. Well, survival was the only thing I was thinking about there. And we did survive. And now we're back on the road. So we should be safer. Well, there is our first blue skull. So I think we've collected like half of the different skulls now or close to half. And I think honestly, on that note, let's go ahead and end it. Um, if you guys are enjoying this uh, content right here with the werewolves, we're going to be streaming this uh, later today after this video goes live, probably a couple hours after. So if you guys have not uh, got enough out of this, then feel free to stop by the live streams as well. I do them five days a week here on YouTube. And we're going to be going after lots of werewolves this week because of the fact that this event is only a week long. So it's going to be a lot of fun. And I hope to see you guys there. If you're brand new to the channel, be sure to subscribe, click the like button, and ring that notification bell so you guys will never miss a video. Also, be sure to leave a comment down below on what you guys enjoyed most about this video. And also on what you guys would consider to be a big werewolf. And I will try to respond to as many of the comments as I can. But with that being said, thank you guys for watching. And I will see you all in the next one. Peace!